Hey guys, and welcome to another brand new video. In this video, we're going to actually go over all the nice little PlayStation 5 restocks going on, some pretty good Amazon deals too, as well we've been touching about and talking about over here, and just a lot of little various random things all floating around. Now, we've had a pretty good past, like, few weeks when it comes to the consoles and restocks, and we're going to have to kind of see this awkward limbo when it comes to this weekend. Now, there is a lot of locations that do have stock, there's a lot of locations that do have the hookup, and as well, if you guys are still on the lookout for some consoles, there should be hopefully some good deals with it. Now, I'm always kind of still curious, too, because uh, let me know how many of you guys even watching this video still even need to get your consoles. I've been on the lookout, and I've been kind of waiting and kind of seeing, uh, but it does always kind of seem like we are getting a lot of folks getting their consoles already, which is very nice to see. So, not sure how long we could keep on doing the restocks for, but I'm just happy we've had a chance to even do with this in the first place, so... Uh, yeah, let's go dive into the video, so make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on, as well for the brand new PlayStation 5 giveaway, and the Amazon links down below for all the nice little Amazon signups, and other various Amazon links for the Black Friday slash, like, I guess at this point, Black Friday is just an entire weekend, I guess, I don't know, and the Twitter and Twitch room down below if you just want to follow for bonus and treats. So, very first and foremost, we've been kind of pushing this a little bit more as well, just kind of, re like, letting people know, but funny enough, we've actually been seeing an even higher uptick right now for online orders for uh, just basically good old Amazon side. So we've been seeing a lot more folks, and I saw this a lot from Black Friday. So I'm not sure if they just had maybe like a pseudo restock going on. Some folks were actually saying it might have been out of stock too as well. Some folks were apparently getting it. It just, I guess, kind of seems because there's like seven different consoles at this point. But as of Black Friday, and I'm not sure, maybe they're going to also try to prep this up and update this up for the uh, next upcoming Cyber Monday. Oh, it's a possibility. But apparently some folks so far, and we'll probably be watching this pretty closely throughout the weekend, have had a chance to go get and look at some of their stock. So if any of you guys do want to be on the lookout, make sure you guys keep on using like the Amazon links down below, as I've been mentioning a lot. Like I think a lot of you guys have been on point and on top of that. But basically, good old PlayStation 5 consoles. All of them seem like they've been kind of floating around in stock. So if you just want to take your risk and see which one you go and get, we've been seeing the God of War Ragnarok bundles, normal by themselves, individual consoles, like the Horizon consoles, the God of War, even digital bundles, and just also normal consoles. We've been seeing these all floating around. So if you guys want to, use the links down below and check that on out. We've also been mentioning a lot of other various individual links too, such as some games actually a bit cheaper. A big thing has been like PlayStation controllers, which we have linked down below. Even you guys can even see like some like Call of Duty is actually on sale $10 off, which is nice to go and see. And a few other various games that might be worth creeping on and checking it out, such as Battlefield. We saw a few other various ones too as well. All might be worth picking on up just to see if they get the good good. So we've been seeing this floating around. If you guys want to check out any of the stock, feel free to. We also have a bunch of stuff like TV, some MacBooks, etc. I'll link down below that might still and sh probably should still be in stock but Amazon will probably be looking pretty good all throughout this weekend as we're going through some good movement. Now some other things to kind of note for all the in stores as we've been mentioning and talking about these past few weeks. Number one, Target side. We've actually had some Target employees go and reach out and let us know that Target actually got brand new additional waves of stock for their PlayStation 5 consoles. So, kind of good to note because we saw, like, a lot of these places maybe around two weeks ago or so, about a week ago or so, right before the, you know, big Black Friday, Cyber Monday restocks, having stock, having stock in other stores. So, as we're seeing this, we're now seeing apparently brand new additional waves, like, basically, the Sony throwing in, like, the, the help helicopter over here and throwing out a lot more additional stock. So, if you guys want to, you should do have our target links down below. If it does go and show limited stock, that means that there is stock then available for those local locations. So go check those out in case you guys would like. But yeah, when it comes to all this type of stock, it's looking good. Like it's vibing really, really good. Uh, I like the idea of it. I think it's coming around going great. And Target stores have been having a plethora of stock everywhere. So if you guys are casually checking your stores, it might be worthwhile for all the big boy stores now that Black Friday is done to see how any stock might be left over. Now, once again, Black Friday may have toned down a little bit of stock too, because obviously a lot of people went to stores and there's kind of like almost programmed to go and do it. So just in case any like the walk-in stuff that we mentioned might be slightly on the lower end or whatever, keep that in mind a little bit. But when it does come with the PlayStation 5s, check out your Target stores in stores. They'll probably still have some leftover stock, especially because we're hearing employees confirming that there is more extra available stock. That also ties into as well for GameStop. GameStop and Best Buy, actually. 
So for both of these locations, we were hearing rumors that they were doing an in-store event. Now, apparently a lot of those rumors did turn out to be true. So if you guys do want to check either the Best Buy store locations or GameStop store locations for the weekend, feel free to. We have had also kind of heard rumors that GameStop itself has also kind of received a mid-restock. Restock? <laughs> those words make sense. We're even seeing them actually having stock available and all the movement and everything with it. So, GameStop's been looking pretty good either for bundles or individual consoles. Just depends on your area, stock, and location when it comes to all of this. So, it's just good. It's just good kind of, I guess, flow to know about. But, uh, also when it comes to Best Buy, as we saw, we did see a lot of locations have like huge, huge influx of stock. And as of right this second, I don't think, I'll, I'll let you guys know if I see more information. I'll do a little bit more digging uh, today, but I don't think we've actually seen too much when it comes to the online potentials. But we did hear some folks saying that they checked their Best Buy stores, did go ask employees, and then the employees said that they had stock in the back, and they were able then to go and sell their consoles to them. So Keep that also in mind in case you guys want to get any good old stock. But when it does come to moving all this one, it looks like Best Buy has been going good. We'll watch and see for online stuff in store. GameStop looking good. Amazon looking good. Now, reminders, we have been seeing a few kind of floating around for those Amazon, like, self-checkout stores in a few select states as well. So we've been hearing that, and it makes sense too, because all these locations have their available by invitations floating around. Now, as kind of a reminder too, we have still been seeing good stuff when it comes to Walmart. Now, uh, depends on, because it kind of keeps on coming on, off, on, off. Uh, so it may be kind of slowly getting out of the stock wise. Like sometimes we actually had it like disappear for a day, then it came back. Right now on the Walmart website, it doesn't seem like there's consoles. Yeah, actually funny enough, it does look like it shows out of stock over here. So just in case you guys are curious, looking like right Right here, basically the PlayStation 5 Gons Console God of War is actually out of stock in their bundles, and then same with the digitals. But, as we've also been mentioning, uh, the at Walmart in-store restock still have been on, kind of on flowing. So we've been seeing stock with them floating around and people getting the hookup on those. So in case you guys want to, it's probably worth checking. Uh, once again, maybe Black Friday and or prepping for Cyber Monday may go on a halt or some stuff. Like, I'll try to give you guys a better update tomorrow. Or kind of if you guys check your store, send me a tweet, send me an email, send me a whatever. I just want to kind of know myself. But as we kind of go through all this whole entire process, we'll probably still kind of, it kind of just is probably sporadic. Probably just depends on your area or if you're lucky or if there's stock or whatever it might be as we're watching for all this stock available. So should be all around, hopefully pretty good. But Walmart in-store should be still looking likely. Same with all the other big retailers we've been mentioning throughout these past few weeks. And then same with, you know, the Amazon stuff too. But it's kind of cool to see that we actually are still seeing sold outs. Uh, it's kind of weird though, because so many other locations have had stock for so long. It's almost weird to go and see a con like before it's expected. Now it almost kind of feels kind of weird that the out of stock is there. Like it just, it doesn't, it doesn't feel right. It doesn't doesn't feel normal, <laughs> you know what I mean? Anyway, so some other little stuff too. We still do have some of the God of War bundles available at the PlayStation Direct, just in case you guys want to lock in and kind of confirm some stock there. So as you guys can see up online, if you guys want to check with the free shipping for PlayStation Plus members, but as well, the PlayStation 5 God of War Ragnarok disc is available, and same with the PlayStation 5 Digital Edition as well is also still available. So check in your PlayStation Direct websites just in case you guys don't want to check the in-stores or don't want to check the Amazon for whatever reason. Totally fine, totally good. This is literally from PlayStation themselves. Now to kind of remind some folks, we still do have some Antonline bundles available for the last minute calls. We have the $510 digital bundle with their headset and such. We have all the consoles too as well, all floating around just in case you guys do want to check those on out for the $610 range or so. So look at the consoles, look at the controllers and get the hookup in case you guys would want to as well. We also are going to be watching this weekend for more of the in-store drops. We're hearing some rumors that some Meyer stores did have some stock for the Black Friday, so maybe check out your local grocery store and go and see. Same thing, too, as well as we saw from the Fred Meyers, Kroger's, and Smith stores and BJ's wholesalers. Still, as well, also floating around when it comes to their stock, potentially up in stores, whether it's up on the app or whether it's up on general various stock. So keep those also in mind. Costco and Sam's Club are on the overdue side and have done weekend restocks before. Verizon still has a little stock floating around too as well. In case you guys want to be able to look out for all of those locations and spots for all their stock. 
or either online or also in the stores. Same with Staples too as well. PC Riches and Dorma, Gamefly, all those locations too are on the very much overdue side for their stock. We'll watch and see for Cyber Monday deals too throughout the weekend or prep ups for that. And of course to be on the lookout for the AGBs, the military online and exchange depots and all of that. So thank you guys all so much for watching. Make sure you guys are subscribed with the notifications on as well for the brand new PlayStation 5, Xbox Series X, or $500 cash giveaway. We have the Twitter and Twitch room down below in case you just want to follow. or the Amazon links down below for all the various sign-up links for Black Friday, Cyber Monday, and consoles too. And the Twitter and Twitch room as well down below. And I appreciate you guys all so much for watching in the first place.